full name. Thank you, Dusty. So now, so now, since I know where you live for sure, I'm coming to see you. I am so excited, y'all, to announce. Oh, my God, let me get my breath. Hold up. <laughs> oh, I feel like this siren's going off in my head and brain. Oh, my God, I'm so excited. Monday was so terrible up until right now, and I got on my favorite program, and I, I just found out AJ's coming to see me, y'all. Oh, my God. I can't wait to find out where he's going to go, and I can't wait to be the first one to buy a ticket. I love me some AJ's Adventures. Hello to all my good friends. This is AJ. Did you miss me? Oh, oh my hope... God, did I miss you, AJ's Adventures. You have not been on the YouTube programs for so long now. It's been like, hmm. Let me think. Seven plus five is minus a three. Get you divided by half the integral of the so x times y, and you divide it. And you go go here. Hold up, AJ. Let me just look, cause I haven't. It's been so. Um, right there it is. Twelve days ago. Wow, it does seem like it has been a whole lot longer since I've been able to watch the AJ's Adventures program. All right. Um, I was on YouTube earlier just going through some shit. Wow! Holy smoking crack! I can't believe you did that! I cannot believe it! <laughs> through some shit and oh good job buddy he just had to leave a message he said something about a greenhouse and crayons and stuff okay for one good job buddy sometimes aj's adventures can get off on a tangent where he ain't exactly explaining the thing he mean to be saying so he's talking about this picture right here and it says Jay Leno on crack, oh my bad, that's fatally. So what he did was, or what I thought had happened was, no, that isn't anyone. You're a child. <laughs> Maybe that's just the greenhouse effects on your crayons, Arnold. Meaning that maybe his crayons was melting when he was trying to draw something. I don't know, but it definitely ain't. Like, of all the people I could think of, this was not about. <laughs> Who would you think it ain't about? I mean, it certainly is trying to pick on some person, but it ain't about somebody else. And I'm trying to think who it possibly could be. Maybe you could help me out with that one, AJ. He said something about a greenhouse and crayons and stuff. What I do love the most about AJ's adventures is that when he went back to his childhood home to live with his mama in the attic, he was not only just using his, uh, you know, how it was when he was there. Look at how old that Motley Crue picture is. That is a very old Motley Crue picture. I have never seen a Motley Crue picture that old and that huge. Oh, it's called a what? A poster? Well, who the fuck hangs posters up in their room anymore like that? I thought we, oldest people, we like to put them in, you know... Oh, I get it. Shoot. Hey, Chase Adventures, you done took an adventure back to your mama's house where you lived when you was a children. I love it. Oh, I love a good old come home story. Thank you, AJ's Adventures, for bringing me up. 
You, you brought a tear to my eye with your come home story. Because now I can tell looking around, you ain't possibly had time to make this whole room look like 1987. I mean, you done got five jobs and six jobs and nine jobs. And you built a race car and you bought a house and you're taking care of your mama. And you done went and you got you what? What did you go do? I forgot. Went down yesterday, filled out my passport for him. Yep. What? <laughs> oh my goodness. H.A.'s Adventure went also down to fill out his passport for You have been one of the busiest people I ever done met inside of four weeks in a brand new town in my whole livelihood. You have decorated the attic, right? with all your Motley Crue jerseys, and you sent Donna downstairs in the basement. Man, you two floors away from that bitch, homeboy. You can party your ass off. Party like a rock star. Party like a rock star. Party like a rock star. Party like a rock Oh, man, you doing a life, though. Hey, could you tell me what you're doing up there to keep yourself busy besides rebuilding your whole entire childhood into an attic? Three jobs in three days. Wow. I volunteer at the greenhouse because that's what friends do, help friends that are struggling. Right. My second job is a horse farm. Holy Moses, you work at a horse farm, AJ? That is so cool, AJ's Adventures. Oh, man, can you show me what you do at the horse farm? When you work at that horse farm, show me what it is. Just show me. What's your specialty? Because you're brand new working on a horse farm. Oh, no shit. He said something about a greenhouse and crayons and stuff. Okay. Well, what it was was, one more time for the one time, because he keeps bringing it up. I don't know why. Jay Leno won't crack on my bad. That's valid. So I said, note that isn't anyone. You're a child. Maybe just that the greenhouse effects on your crayons, Arnold. Right? Hey, hey, hey. Ha, ha, ha. Your crayons is melting. Oh, he wrote something back. I didn't even see it. Why don't you worry about the shit going on with your son and stay out of mine and faking bacon's business? It's got nothing to do with you. Okay, well. Um, what about this? Has got anything to do with Canadian bacon? That's what I'm axing. For one good job, buddy. Eddie. Yeah. Ed Weirdo. Right. The shit going on between me and Canadian Bacon has nothing to do with you, so keep the fuck out of it. Why do you think that that has anything to do with Canadian Bacon? It doesn't. And you just keep on doubling, tripling down. And you're wrong when you're going to get this shit figured out what is going on. Please do not threaten my son right now, oh lord. If I was you, I'd be worried what's going on with your son. Yep. Before anything else. What? You see what I mean? Yep. Okay, I'm glad you do. Oh my God, please! So, here's the difference between me and you, good job, buddy. You? Yep. Mm-hmm. Nice. I love a four-leaf clover.